Welcome, it's Facts You Don't Know. If it's your first time here and you want to find out new facts that will definitely make you smarter and more. Well, and for make sure to subscribe and active the notification bell so you don't miss anything. The most important stage of a person's life that needs care is the aging stage. As the person returns weak, needs care in all respects, psychological, physical, nutritional, and health. Because of the importance of this stage in humans, many civil society institutions have specialized in caring for the elderly, and international laws have attached great importance to the elderly. In order to be able to properly care for the elderly, it's necessary to know the changes that occur in them in the stage of life, such as physical and psychological changes. In addition to dietary, health, and social changes, we'll tell you this exciting story that tells how relatives of this grandmother abandoned her and left her alone sick in an old house. And when they returned home a year later, it was surprising. When the family members could buy houses in the city and decided to leave, they left the grandmother, Anna Petrovna, alone in an old worn-out house, located in a small village belonging to the province of Varunag in Russia, thinking that she was very sick and that she would die soon. The grandmother was 70 years old and she was suffering from several diseases that made all her relatives tired of taking care of her and why they decided to abandon her and not take her with them to the city. The family members could buy houses in the city and decided to leave. They left the grandmother, Anna Petrovna, alone in an old worn-out house located in a small village belonging to the province of Veronag in Russia, thinking that she was very sick and that she would die soon. The grandmother was 70 years old, and she was suffering from several diseases that made all of her relatives tired of taking care of her, and why they decided to abandon her and not take her with them to the city. The family members of that old grandmother promised to return a year later to visit her, and they left her and left her sick. But a year later, relatives returned to shock all of them with what their eyes saw. Instead of finding their grandmother had passed away, they found her full of mental health and physical strengths. They found that she had restored the house and made it a beautiful modern home, and also created a beautiful garden in front of the house where she planted roses and trees. Also planted some vegetables and many animals and she took care of them and made her a friend. The grandmother also installed wooden chairs in the garden to sit on and rest and have tea. The grandmother was not satisfied with only this, as she now sells the vegetables, fruits, eggs, and milk you earn from the garden in the village market and makes sizable sums, where she managed to collect a large sum that allowed her to reformulate the old house, bought new furniture, and made it a modern home. Grandma said she did all of this with the help of her neighbor who was visiting her every day. After her family left and reassured her and took her to the doctor until her condition improved, and she recovered from the disease completely. A neighbor like that was marginalized by her children, but she decided to take up the challenge and not rely on anyone in this life. And she raised the challenge and became living alone and taking care of herself. And the two grandmothers began to regain their passion for life together and share sweet and sour, and were finally able to reach their goal, where they enjoy their time working and touring the village together. The children and grandchildren of that grandmother stayed with her for some weeks and tried to ascertain what the grandmother was doing, and with the passage of days they made sure that she was really in good health and dependent on herself in everything, and even refused to provide her with assistance. The grandmother developed her projects in the small estate where she lives, where she bought boxes for beekeeping and bought other livestock to have a small farm full of animals, in addition to fields where many plants are planted, and sold and earn a lot of money. She became known to all the villagers who had heard her story, and they were rushing to buy goods that she offered as encouragement, which made her trade develop. The grandmother began helping all the needy in the village, especially the elderly, because she was feeling the pain in them and suffering that they experience after their children abandoned them and left them. As she allocates several visits every month to some elderly people and gives them the kind of vegetables, fruits, and grains and gives them charity with money. The grandmother found with her neighbor that she did not find with her children and grandchildren, who brought them up and made sure to feed, teach, and care for them for a long time. And when they grew up and became successful in their lives, they noticed that her powers began to play down and became very sick. They abandoned her and left her alone to suffer. The grandmother also gave a message to those who think that their children are merely a commodity, ending with the end of their validity period, that they're wrong and that they'll meet the same fate with their children and grandchildren one day. 
Grandmother also showed us that a person should continue to struggle in this life until the last minute of his life and not gives up no matter how old he is because society is ruthless and people have become unrecognizable and focus on their private lives. Thanks for watching. Please like and share the video in social networks. We'll be right back to you as fast as we can.